All right, and now the assignment. Um, this you can download this from uh, Blackboard right there on the under the announcements. Uh, it, this organizer is worth fifty percent of the first draft grade. So you're going to turn this in with your first draft. Um, you're going to fill this out, and this is due at the end of the class on the fifth. Um, take it seriously, but be honest. Um, you're going to create this letter. Um, it should be about, you know, probably one and a half to two pages double spaced. It might be longer. It definitely is not going to be any shorter than that. And you're writing it from your view now. So you don't know if the child will be a boy or a girl. You don't even know anything about the parents, um, which might be your actual child, children or adopted children. I don't know. Um, and this will be opened by that grandchild on the grandchild's 16th birthday. So these are the four things I want you to think about. And you might even use these to organize into maybe four paragraphs. I'm not sure. It kind of depends on how you want to, but you're definitely going to paragraph this thing. So a description of you on this, of this, you know, what, what do you look like? What's your personality? What are the things you like to do? Always think about the why, the describing of the why as you go through this, especially when you get into the writing process. Um, because this is you at this age, and the more you specific you can be about yourself and the whys, um, then you're not some old fogey that's like 60. You're, you're a, a teenager, and that 16-year-old will be able to relate to you. Your goals for the future, like what do you want to do in a year or two or five or ten? And again, why? Like what from your life? The more you can connect this to your life experience and your life stories, the better. Um, the world that you currently live in, um, it could be the social world. If you're like you're, you know, like hey, I'm on the football team, and this is what I do, and 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 this is what Liberty High School is like, or this is what's going on in the world today, politically, or whatever. I don't know. And you can think about in terms of the one student that wrote about technology, and that's this world that's obsessed with technology. But try to think about that, um, because the world's going to change a lot in the next 45 years, and you know, to give a sense of what life is like in 2017 from your point of view, I think is strong. And then again, your advice or the counsel that you might give from your time. You have a lot to say. You've got a lot of experience. So tell him or her what your advice um, for to a 16-year-old, but also base it on experiences. The more honest you can be about the things that you've succeeded in and the screw-ups you've had. I would love that, speaking as, as someone that just lost his grandfather. I know the great moments of being with him were when he would sit down and tell me about what his life like was in Opie, Kansas, and the kind of things he used to do and how he used to get in trouble and the fun things that they did and the things that you might think are mundane but are, are engaging to a grandchild to think, wow, you used to be young and cool. So think in terms of that as you build this letter and then think about proper letter format as you turn this in and you're going to turn this in at the end of class on the fifth and then I'll look at it and give it back to you um, the full letter with this outline all right good luck